Can you make a flappy fish game in Scratch? You control a fish and help it swim through the pipes. We can make this in very simple steps. Let's start. First, we will upload a blue backdrop that looks like we are underwater. This will be the ocean where our fish swims. Next, remove the scratch cat. Then upload the sprites we need for this game. We will add a fish sprite for the player to control and a pipe sprite that the fish needs to swim through. Now we need to set up two variables. The first one is called speed. This controls how fast the fish moves up and down when we play. The second variable is called score. This keeps track of how many pipes the fish successfully swim through. Now let's start coding the fish. When the green flag is clicked, set both of the speed and score to zero. Then set the fish size to 60%. Move the fish to its starting position on the screen. Let's use a forever loop to make the fish fall naturally. Move the fish down by the amount stored in the speed variable. Then change the speed so the fish start to fall more quickly. This creates gravity for the fish. Now, let's make the fish jump. If the space key is pressed, set speed to a positive number. This will make the fish swim upward. You can also add a bubble sound here. Now let's code the pipe. When the green flag is clicked, hide the pipe. Use a forever loop. Create a clone of myself every five seconds. When I start as a clone, make the pipe show. Set the size to be bigger. Start in a random position on the right side of the screen. Now let's make the pipe move to the left. Use a repeat until loop. Keep moving by minus two steps to the left. If the pipe reaches the left edge of the stage, increase the score by one. Then delete the clone so it disappears. If the pipe touches the fish, stop all. This will end the game when the fish hits the pipe. And that's it. You just made the Flappy Fish game in Scratch. If you like this video, please hit like and subscribe. See you in the next game.